Welcome back, everybody. Pack opening addict. The Crimson Vow release has been interesting. Um, between Rudy making a joke that Crimson Vow is challenging AFR for least popular magic set of all time, watching Bad Boy Gaming open up uh, some set boosters that had like insane pull rates of Mythics, and it was like all showcase cards. It was insane. To other people out there that are reporting where their boxes like didn't have any showcase or borderless cards in any way shape or form these set boosters for crimson vow i wondering and i have to wonder because wizards won't say it is the fact that there's no stock is because they screwed these up well i got a box here actually i've got a bunch of boxes but let's pop this open let's see how we do right i'm still after the cultivator colossus Oops, I pulled too many pets and they went sliding because I am clumsy. All right, just for now, I'm just going to take this thing off of here, hopefully. Okay, there we go. Get rid of that. And let's start a ripping. And not Japanese, okay. So you're gonna have, it's been a little bit since I've done a set booster. So you're that, you're gonna have land, you're gonna have commons, commons, commons of a certain amount. Bramble worm, retrieve, then we're back to commons again, I guess. Belligerent, guest, Baldarin, epicure, overcharged amalgam for solid first rare. So it looks like this is not gonna be one of those uh, all of the mythics and showcase cards one could ever want boxes. So I guess not an error box. That is a signed art card, I guess. I've seen that signature before. Who is that again? Nicholas Gregory. So Arm the Cathars. Angelic Quartermaster. Back to Commons. Call it this guest. Timothar in Lords of the Underworld. Okay, and a dominating vampire. Into the night in hard. You seriously added a card for Modern Horizons 2 on the list? Oh, good old list. Good old list. Okay, so we've got Thirst of Discovery into the night again. Mischievous Catgeist. I still want to know why the ball of yarn is a geist. Investigator's Journal. Groom's Finery. I know somebody's going to answer that. Like, it's a geist, it's an apparition, it can make whatever form it wants. So it's a cat playing with a ball of yarn. Yeah, yeah, okay, fine. Griffin Wing Cavalry, laid to rest. Lay this to rest. Okay, Radiant Grace, Lurian Suitor, Skulking Killer, Giralf. Visionary Stitcher. I had not actually looked at this card yet, but I'm not going to do it right now because we've got a bunch of packs. Okay, Distracting Geist, and a whole lot of nothing. Well, at least we got one Mythic so far from uh, Commander. The Commander uh, release stuff. Lantern of the Lost, cool card. Lunar Rejection. In fact, I'm going to put that aside. Back to commons. What was with these commons in the middle? I know I always say that, but Sh uh, Shattered Sanctum, first of the land cycle. Markov Purifier Foil. That's kind of cool. So 
So we got saw blade stinger, resistance squad, twin blade geist, because one blade is not good enough. Curse of Hospitality, Honeymoon Hearse, and nothing. Nothing too exciting yet. Most exciting thing being the Shattered Sanctum. Breathkeeper Seraph. That's cool. I have no idea if that's holding up, but that's a cool card. Thalia in the showcase. That actually is pretty cool looking. I like that. I dig that a lot. Ha <laughs> ha! Ah, oh, neat. <laughs> Double Thalias. Now can we get a double Soren pack? Eh? 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 Olenbach Escort, Guardian Paladin, Blista Watcher, Back to Commons, Markov Pure Fire, Runo Stromkirk. I want to build a Runo deck. Uh, is this even a hit right now? Seriously, good question. I don't know. Noxious Ghoul from Legions. Interesting. I mean, it goes with the, it all, so that, that's why it's interesting. It's not like a bad pull. It's a, fits with Innistrad, so, you know, neat. What am I doing with my life? There we go. Glorious Stance, Skulker, back to commons. Thundering Nightmare, huh? Again, we have to read that later. Alchemist Gambit, Ancient Lumber Knot, nope. Thundering Mightmare, it's not even Nightmare, ooh, Foil Land, uh, yeah. Cartographer Survey, Lumber Knot, Spiked Ripsaw. Cummins, Cummins, Sundown Pass, very nice. And a foil wedding announcement. Elspeth Conquers Death from Thero sorry, Theros uh, Beyond Death. Cool card. Not a list hit at rare. I don't know what they added to the list for this set, though. Oh, sweet, another foil land. Another Lantern of the Lost. Catilda, I doubt that thing is holding up, and Halana and Elena. Exuberant Wolf Bear from Ikoria. So I got a Modern Horizons 2, a Theros Beyond Death, and an Ikoria list card. Wow, really just giving us uh, things that are like still kind of around, huh? I know, they gave us something from Legions, which, again, yeah. neat. Hopeful Initiate. Scab. Okay. Well, we're really sitting at, I mean, I kind of want to count that separately in the Mythics. I don't know if it is or not, but I do feel like based off past boxes, you should get one Mythic. Uh, from Commander, so it means we've actually gotten no Mythics yet. Is that correct? Huh. Weird. Runebound. Wolf. Peck song, Peck song. Pup. Innocent Traveler. Volatile Arsonist. Okay, our first Mythic. And that's a Dire Strain Anarchist. Well, it's... Okay. Oh, Shinka! Sweet! I didn't know they added that to the list. That's cool. With the Kamigawa lands. Oh, that's that's sweet. That's what I like about the list. Right there. Just surprising. I, I, I mean, I know some of them went way up. I don't think that one did, but it, it doesn't matter. That's cool. I dig it.
Path of Peril, which I, I now know what it does. Unholy Efficient. I now understand, after the 10,000 comments, what Cleave does in fact do. That's what I get for filming before checking it out. It's what I get. By invitation only, this card has dropped like a rock. Oh, a foil lantern lost. That's fun. Still waiting for that Cultivator Colossus. That is the card. Strephon Mar Progenitor. So, one of the vampire commanders. So, that's two commander mythics. Consuming Tide. I would like some regular set mythics, not the commander mythics, please. Come on. Oh, really? Seriously? Whatever, fine. Oh, a third foil land. Ripsaw, Brandable Worm, Commons, Brian Com Comer. Markov Purifier, and Splendid Reclamation. That's a cool card. I could make use of that. Oh, Lightning Bolt. Okay, from M25, cool. Now we got Bride's Gown. So the two halves of the equipment. Lantern Flare. And this is something cool coming up. Shattered Sanctum in the awesome Borderless Foil. That's a sweet hit. Take that. I'd buy that for a dollar. So this is not an error box. I'll admit there was a small part of me that was hoping it was, and that'd be such a cool video to make. But nope, not that lucky. Helena and Elena. Dorothea. Dive Scab. Next pack. Come on, Mythics, show up. I'll take more lands. If you really, if you really, really want, I'll take more slow lands. Statuette again, Blood Tithe Harvester, Infestation Expert, yeah. Savior of Allenbach. Not the mythic I want to see, just because off my original openings and I got like a whole bunch of these. So like I'm good here. Um, but, neat card. We'll see how it plays. Alright, I'm going to stop here for a moment. And I want to open the box stopper. Not never in a mil never in a million years would I have thought that the market on these would have vanished so quickly. Search the Count's, ca Count's Castle. Yeah, that, that is a card. At least that one's a cool card in Thirst of Discovery. There's four, sorry. Bloodsworn Squire, Bloodsworn Knight, Wedding Security, and Cemetery Desecrator. Lunar Rejection, and a Blood Pet from Tempest. I think, so we might have one more list card, but that probably is going to be it. We already have pulled two rares off of it, so that's... Next one will either be an uncommon or a common, but it looks kind of like it's going to be a common. I hate that. That's so predictable. Oh, Henrika. 
Tom Naffy. All right, so we got six mythics. So quite a few packs to go too. Ooh, storm carved coast, beautiful. And we got a creepy puppeteer. Not as beautiful, but still, storm carved, sorry, ah, storm carved coast in the borderless treatment. That is a sweet card. Gotta love the slow lands. Hive Heart Shaman, Rending Flame Foil. Oh, another foil land. Dollhouse of Horrors. It's a Guardian Paladin foil. Now it looks like we're not going to have the Cultivator Colossus. Which means I'll have to open up another box. Because that's what we do here. Oh, Ascendant Pack Leader. It's not the same if I buy it off somebody. I need to pull it out of a pack. Blood Vile Purveyor and Iruth. That's the regular artwork for that, huh? I like the regular artwork way better. Yep, and there's an uncommon. We got Moonhold. Cool. That's neat. All right, three packs left. So that's it for the list. Will we get one more Mythic? Can we get one more Slow Land? Slow Land. The slowest of lands. Hollow Henge Overlord. That's neat. And Edgar, Charmed Groom. Edgar's Awakening. That wasn't a bad pack at all. There's for discovery. Welcoming vampire. Nice hit. All right. One last pack, everybody. It's looking like my quest is not complete. Oh, we got a second sign card. That is a cool signature. So change of fortune, Sam Gway. That's Sam. That's a cool signature. Chandra! We did get one more mythic. All right, well, I mean, in the end, that feels like an okay box, yeah? Am, am I missing something like that? That feels... Four of the lands, seven mythics, several other really cool rares. Yeah, that, that, seemed, that seemed not terrible. Thanks for watching, everybody. Till the next video, because now I do have to search for the Cultivator Colossus, I got to do another box. Till next time, bye.